So Nish, um, you're here in Rowland's Castle, you're a pharmacist and your wife here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, can you let me know a bit about how Covid has affected your pharmacy? Yeah, absolutely. So we've been pharmacists for 15 years and um, since Covid from March it's been exceptionally busy. The busiest it's ever been in our professional careers. Um, there's been a surge in demand for prescriptions, surge in demand for advice and support, um, lots of concern and worried people within Rowlands Castle. So yeah. pharmacy has really been frontline, um, frontline key workers uh, looking after the community and providing them the very best possible care that they need um, during these testing and worrying times. And you've had lots of volunteers I think, haven't you? Absolutely, the Rowlands Castle um, support group has been fantastic. It, um, uh, they, came to fruition very quickly, effectively overnight, and there's a lot of volunteers um, that have supported the pharmacy through this um, crisis, um, maybe 12 to 16 volunteers that have been uh, juggling their families and their home lives and their own personal concerns, but putting themselves on the front line, uh, picking up medication and delivering to uh, the many um, elderly and vulnerable residents within the community. Yeah. And you've had some lovely pictures here from the yes, children. Yes, we, we did a lovely competition with St John's School um, I think it was year two, so the sixes and sevens, um, yeah. and they've done some fantastic pictures, um, just to try and get them engaged into COVID as well, just so they can sort of heighten their understanding of what's happening and um, try and get them involved um, uh, through And are times. you going to get a holiday at all? Well, I hope so. Um, yes, um, hopefully we You were just telling me you've worked non-stop, uh, day in, day out, from five o'clock in the morning, yeah. <laughs> even during bank holidays and the weekends. Yes, it's been exceptionally challenging, and I think um, Kay and the team who have worked exceptionally hard all deserve time off. We had to work through the bank holidays, as you said, yeah. um, as per NHS directive. So hopefully with things slowly curtailing and easing down now, um, there will be opportunity just to get a few days off. Well, yeah. can I thank you very much for all oh, the work you've done? Nice I know that everybody in the village thinks so highly of you, so oh. thank you so much. Thank you, thank you.